Cloud services provisioning is essential to the way organisations of all sizes are interacting and serving their end customers. Cloud is rapidly changing the competitive landscape. It's accelerating the speed with which organisations can get close to and stay close to their customer. Without cloud, time to market is harder and those who don't adopt quickly won't be left behind. I think there are two things behind the speed of this cloud shift. The first of these is the changing customer expectations. Customers expect services to be simple, to be secure, to be online, to be synchronised, to be intelligent. Secondly, we have the hyper-digital adoption. Mobile and social technologies are creating a drag for cloud. So rather than traditional IT pushing technology towards businesses, the market is creating an urgent and rapid demand for cloud. In the last two to three years, we've really seen these trends converge and I think in the next two to three years, we will see yet another shift, partly because of the millennials, digital natives, who will be entering the workplace and the marketplace. Customer demand is moving us away from product and technology towards flexible cloud service catalogues with easily consumable chunks. The challenge, however, is that the customer doesn't want to experience or even know about the increasingly complex multi-vendor supply chain behind that. There's increased commercial pressure on organisations to deliver integrated SLAs. IBM Smart Analytics Cloud helps customers navigate those challenges. Firstly, by deriving insight from customer segment and behaviour to create a single view of the customer. And secondly, by bringing forward trusted information to enhance the customer experience. Really, in my opinion, getting even more focused on customers is becoming absolutely essential, more so than it ever has been before. And creating cloud services is absolutely key in order to meet the changing demands of, from what we're seeing from customers today. But to add to that, tuning them very specifically to the industry sector in which they apply to is becoming absolutely unique and essential to competitive advantage for businesses today. And the cloud really offers the opportunity to differentiate uh, and gain competitive advantage by using cloud technologies to connect with their clients in very different ways. In, in my experience with one particular client, Birmingham Metropolitan College, which is one of the largest and most successful FE colleges in the UK with over 35,000 learners, they've been able to um, create something revolutionary with IBM and with myself called Classroom in the Cloud, which is social learning technologies, collaboration tools, and abilities to network that they've never had before. And it has completely transformed the way in which they deliver education and the way in which they operate as a business. So specifically, they've been able to move away from chalk and talk and connect with their learners at anywhere, anytime, on demand through any device, completely changing the way in which they operate as a business to more than 26,000 learners. And so bringing that back, you know, that's absolutely had a transformational impact to their competitive advantage in the industry using cloud technologies through IBM. I feel the increased use of social technologies represents a fundamental shift in human behavior. And actually that's reshaping service businesses, but also service consumption from across any industry. And this phenomenon has not just created a new communication channel, but completely changed the way in which we collaborate with people, we connect with content, and the way we work, play, and even pay for things. And really, I, I believe this is driven from the digital native generation. They are coming out of the womb with this expectation that these emerging technologies are going to be a part of not just their education, but their working life and, and with their colleagues. They are completely immersed in cloud, social and mobile technologies in their personal lives and they're looking for that to extend into the real world and into the workplace. So really, it falls back on industry to look at those implications of engaging with those technologies because the, the pull and the demand from industry and, and the market is absolutely there. 
And really, in my opinion, cloud, mobile, social, data, and analytics technologies are completely changing the way in which I'm connecting with my clients and the way in which they are connecting with their customers. And therefore, totally revolutionizing the ecosystem of industry that we have and working towards a smarter planet. So in summary, we are at an exciting time. We're going to continue to see changes with cloud from a technology perspective. We will see shifts in the way data, social data, are going to connect and engage with services in a different way to provide more enhanced customer experiences. And thirdly, I think we're really going to see changes in the way people and consumers and social dimensions engage with this discussion. We're going to see increased focus on outcomes, business and social outcomes. And at its heart, this is going to be a leadership agenda. This is not only going to be about technology, but it's also going to be about how we are responding to the requirements of an increasingly instrumented and interconnected planet.